Invocation by Alfred Austin. Thy alpinant slopes unto Tuscan plain, and breaks unto dimples and loves the flowers, to see where the terrors of wind are vain, and out of a well of grape and grain, the blossom city of dooms and towers. Toyed in Lombard and grasping Gaul, prince and pontiff have forced their way, afforded the river and scale for wall, and made in its palace a style and stall, with spears might glisten the war sits nigh. And ever since Florence was fair and young, and the sun upon her and belfry shone, where her windows bannered and joy bells rung, and back to his saddle the stranger sprung, and lances were lifted and pigmen gone. Yes, ever and ever till you, my queen, come over for sea that is all your own, and the tear on the tip of the wine is seen, and the fig tree crests have flamed to green, and the wind flow awakeneth, and tulip blown. And roses for shower before your feet, the lily crowned gonfalls with both, and children chanted in square and street, all hail to the monarch may free man great, who skept his peace and whose throne is love. And now that each snow torrent foams and folds, and the orioles sing and the skylarks soar, and the lift swallows circle her rose white woods with clefts of happen and florence calls, the welcome and spring come back once more. Come back with a course on its way, and the mountains smiling await your smile, and still my olive groves bask and stray till the warm winged waters and winds of May shall waft you back to your own loved eye. The sickle have performed its work, the sickle have performed its work, the storm guys sweep the aspens bare, carrying clouds and shadows murk, come to the disheartened air. The swallow circles around the roof, not shed, redeems the dripping shed, their gables from reproof, why not already fled?